everything you just saw is from the last three years of my life, and all of those experiences have made me into who I am today. So who am I? My name's Sam Newton, I'm a 25-year-old travel videographer, and I look nothing like this guy. Okay, fine, that's not my voice either. But the intro would have looked way less cool with me in it, so let's just roll with that. I wanted to use this video as a journal of all my adventures in the past three years and show you my journey to becoming a full-time travel videographer. But to tell my story correctly, we need to start at the very beginning of my career when I got my first camera. Back then I did my best at making videos with what I had and they were pretty bad. Okay, they were really bad. But those early videos I created were the ones that made me fall in love with videography. Fast forward a hundred sorority videos, a couple corny rap songs, and I was out of college. And that's where my story as a travel videographer begins. So here you go. Three years, 30 countries. All my stuff is in here. We fit, fit all of our clothes in that bag. All right. LAX, we here. It's real. My first trip was with my best friends, Gabe and Lewis. We had just graduated, we were all broke as hell, so we thought why not spend all of our money chasing women in Europe. And that's what we did. We sent 5,000 emails and I got my first sponsor, a clothing company called Calibus. We took off to Ireland, smoked weed in Amsterdam, drank way too much in Munich, and my mission to fall in love in Europe failed pretty hard. But that's okay, because remember that clothing company? Well, they wanted to fly me to Guam to film a reggae music festival, then I hopped on a plane to film for a charity in Kenya for free, bought a ticket to Asia, and everything changed. After reaching out to 5,000 more companies, I got my second sponsor, Vincero Watches. I slid in their DMs and they were like, yeah, dude, you're super sick, go film some stuff in Asia. While I was there, I met a kid named Luke Jackson Clark, a photographer from London. I told him I wanted to start a travel media company. He said, yeah, mate, me too, cheerio, or something like that. And that's when our company, Move to Create, was born. The first trip we went on was Iceland. We snowmobiled on the glacier, saw the northern lights. It was super cool, but we didn't really make any money. The second trip we went on was Europe. We got to train through Switzerland for free, but we still made no money. But the third trip went a bit differently. I filmed the commercial, worked with one of the world's biggest hotels, and we actually came back with money in our pockets. It was such an insane feeling to see an idea we had in a hostel come to life. We weren't done. We road tripped the West Coast, went to Hawaii, flew back out to Europe, went on another road trip, went to Japan, and before I knew it, I was 25 years old screening this video to the people I care about most. Time for the next adventure. <laughs>